I'm guessing the devil. No, 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 no. Okay. of course not. Shame. Talk about religion. Okay, Ignat, you're right here for an interview of the fantastic job of the butcher. You're so <laughs> <in> it. <laughs> Please answer to these two questions. So, this is actually a true story. My first word uh, when I was born was meat. And uh, everybody in my family knows that, and uh, I'm very good at it. Secondly, uh, Guzman is the, my second best place where I uh, eat, where I enjoy the greatest, the rarest of steaks, and of course medium rare, not the well done, I'm not eating the shoes. I know a lot about meat, trust me, from personal experience, which is very, very big. It might not be so obvious, but uh, this great person, this fitness trainer, helped me to drop 20 kilograms two years ago. Yeah, I was like, oh, you shouldn't be... <laughs> so yes, you give me a big A. I should come here. <laughs> So you give me a big apron, I'm good with a knife, also I'm like not a jiu-jitsu guy, but I know my other way around the knife. I will guess we'll get some results. Next 90 days, well, I guess a new restaurant. I believe Toastmasters should ha has its own brand, its brand of meat, a place where we should all be able to eat. So 90 days, simple, no problem, we'll have our own meat franchise and maybe in the hope of, yeah, like that. Thank you very much, Ignat. I think ribeye is a little cosmetic. Yeah, that's thank nice. you very much. Okay.